Hi, Virgo. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, comment, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message from you. How is Virgo coming to the reading? Weary. Queen of Swords. That is a uh, female Virgo uh, with the Six of Cups here. So something about backwards, uh, connecting backwards, wanting to go backwards, wanting things to be at a simpler place here. Maybe with a particular person with a soulmate. Uh, you don't know what's going on. You don't know if somebody is uh, talking to someone from their past. Four of Cups. You want to know uh, why is someone not taking to your offer? Ten of Pentacles. You want to know if somebody's still married or, or they're going to let this go? Or is it just sex with you? Are they ever going to get a divorce? Why can't they see you for what you really are is what the cards are saying. Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles is like maybe you're re realizing your worth here. And you're asking, you're demanding what is going on here. Yeah, you want to know the truth of the matter. Maybe they kept you in the dark too long. Yeah, they keep sneaking around too long. Seven of pen seven of swords. They could even ghost you at times or come back when they want to. It's like you definitely want to come out of the dark with this person. Could be dealing with a Libra. You want to know if this person wants a family, if they really want to be together. What do they want? Because it's just not going to be more fun and you know, pleasurable nights and, and days. You're putting an end to it. You can, you're telling someone that they can't keep coming in and out. They're going to have to stick around. That you guys can't just keep making up my way of sexual activity. You understand that a decision needs to be made. Someone needs to decide. You don't want to hang around and wait on this any longer. You've done enough. You've twisted yourself in knots and done so much to remain in this relationship. And, and yet and still you haven't been chosen this person hasn't given you it's just a lot of uncertainty because this person is still acting like they're this happy life happy home and keeping you as the other woman what is the advice for Virgo I'm listening to a song that says the ordinary just won't do I need a love that's pure and true. Yeah, maybe that's how you feel. You're going to find that in your in your uh, higher power, whatever it is you believe in. Let's see, what is the advice? Somebody's handsome, and maybe that's why you deal with a lot with them here. You know, maybe that's what you, your hang-up is. Yeah, there's gossip about you, or you want to know. About what this person's plans are. The cards are saying you're hard-headed. Maybe they've shown you. Yeah, I don't know if this person was cheating while she's pregnant. Or while someone was pregnant. You know the smart thing to do. Okay. You already know what the smart decision is. And it's probably to walk away. Cut ties. Let's see. Yeah, because somebody's still trying to save their marriage. Do the rational thing. This is just going to be hard for you to handle. You need to take your care out of this because someone is not divorcing. By Christmas, it could still be the same thing and it could be even more theatrics and no growth to this relationship. Yeah, so that's what I have for you, Virgo. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website, book your own reading there, ask a question or two. By texting it to the number below. You can also catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.